Okay. Okay. I don't know how happy my chicken is. He kind of got attacked by a fox. I really wouldn't say well done, but okay. Okay. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed those cinematic type shot thingy my bobbers yeah in the building of my room but now we are moving on to the next thing which is going to be I don't I hear a spider and I don't know where it's coming from but we're gonna ignore that and I also hear a skeleton don't know where that's from either but we're gonna ignore it anyways anyways um we're gonna talk to you Liv, as well as check in with I, I don't know their names so we're gonna look the Joanne and Ashley so we have to talk to those two people and then we're going to try to build a cafe today. And that's going to be the end of the episode then because I'm trying to do a little bit of shorter episodes because lately they have been long when I've been editing them and that is not my purpose and I don't want to be splitting them up like I did with episode six and seven. So let's go talk to the chicken coop person. I think that's Ashley, but it could be wrong. I Is she open today? I hope she's open today because I didn't even think about that. Ashley! Okay. Oh, I need another voice, don't I? Oh, no. Okay, um, oh, she just walked away. Okay, <laughs> no one likes me in this town. Okay, um, they're gonna sound the same. I'm sorry, I I'll try my best, but yeah. Uh, I love this place. Isn't it wonderful, Mr. Fox? I hope I get to stay here for longer. Oh, hello. Sorry, I didn't see you there. I was just, uh, never mind. Anyway, welcome to my poultry farm. My name is Ashley. Do you know how to take care of chickens? Huh? No. <laughs> no, I don't. But I would like the goods, so please show me. Oh, you don't know. Well, the first thing... Well, first things first. You must feed your chickens. If you don't, they will get sick and stop producing anything. You can feed chickens by hand. Or with a feeding tray. Oh, so it's like the cows. Okay, that's pretty cool. Okay, so chickens like us need a bit of love too. To show a chicken that you love it, just make sure to pick it up every day. You can pick up chickens by right-clicking them. They love it. <laughs> okay. I don't know how I would feel if I was constantly being picked up, but you know, that's fine. That's fine. Uh, just right-click the ground again to throw them back down. Oh! We're throwing chickens? <laughs> Let's not. No wonder the chickens in the mine attacked me. We're throwing chickens around. No, we're not gonna do. No. Okay, N not gonna do that. But let's just let's just continue reading. Feeding by hand also makes a chicken love you a bit more. A happier chicken will produce bigger and better eggs. And then she's giving me some feed for the chickens. Awesome. Can you go feed this chicken and show it some additional love? Then come back to me. Okay. Oh, <gasps> chicken. Where are you going? No, 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 chicken. Okay, we need to take our chicken somewhere. This isn't gonna be a problem with Emmy, right? Emmy looks very interested at the moment. I don't like that. <laughs> um, we're gonna put our chicken with a cow because I don't think it'll be a problem personally, but we'll see. It may be a problem. <gasps> oh, it's going for my chicken! It's going for my chicken! <gasps> is trying to kill my chicken okay chicken I see you I see what you do in there I don't like what you do in there can you not like the fox is gonna try to kill you why are you doing that okay that's that's just that's just wonderful Okay, guys. Okay, um, I didn't think this through. Our chicken is almost dead because it wants to get out of the cage, and we have. Okay, you know what? I'm really sorry, Fox. Doggo, go get it. That really won't work, actually. But that's okay. We need to talk to Yulip before it's too late. So where is our lovely buddy? Yulip. Whoop. Nope, Yulif ain't down there. Okay, where is Yulif? Yulif! Oh! 
You're right there, buddy. Hey there. Uh, I want to buy something from you, and I would like to buy the cafe. Bam. Okay, perfect. So we can place this down while we have the other stuff building. You know what? I can work with that. I can solidly work with that. We're going to place that down. Have fun with that. Okay. Now we need to go talk to one other person. I think he's, I think he's right there, actually. Hello there. Okay, so, oh no, this is Jim. <laughs> That's not who I want to talk to. I want to talk to, no, that's Jade. I, you know what? Actually, guys, if I'm being honest, I don't know who I'm supposed to be talking to. Is it Ashley? Well, I did, I do need to talk to Ashley. Well done. It looks like you know how to take care of your chickens. As mentioned before, happier chickens make bigger eggs. Okay. Okay. I don't know how happy my chicken is. He kind of got attacked by a fox. I really wouldn't say well done, but okay. Okay. But how do I get eggs, you ask? That, that's not what I was asking at all, actually. I, I, I really want to talk about the whole fox thing. You kind of should have warned me, you, you know? Like, okay, you know, fine. It's okay. it's okay. Well, my dear, simply place a nest box nearby, and eventually the chicken will lay an egg. Okay, that's great, but again, the fox was a problem that we should probably discuss. She's not listening. Okay. <laughs> Great. They'll only lay an egg once a day, however. They won't lay eggs unless they have been fed. Once you've collected your eggs, don't... Wait, before you continue, can we talk about the fox? That, that's kind of... Uh, mm. Don't forget to ship them off for some gold. I have a nest box for you. Come back and see me when you've gotten an egg from your chicken. Great. Okay. That's just... That's just peaches. So, guys. Okay. We're back, and I think it's done. I have thought it was done a lot of times, so I'm hoping this is... Oh, I think it is. Okay, let's go talk to her. Ah, I'm so excited. Okay. Granny Caitlin. Oh, I don't know how I'm going to do this voice, but we're, we're going to try. Good day, youngin. I'm Caitlin, but you can call me Granny if you like. I help out my granddaughter, Liara, mostly in the kitchen. I must thank you for letting me open her shop here. It's been her lifelong dream. I have some spare change. It isn't much, but please do take it. Oh, oh did she just give me money? <gasps> That's sweet. Thank you. Someday I'll make the best blanket you've ever seen. Aw. Okay. So let's look at our quest. And it says, go talk to Lyra. Nice to meet you. I'll get you a blanket as well one day. I promise I will. I'll try my ultimate best. Okay, where is Liara? Liara? Liara. I think it's Liara we're looking for. <laughs> um, we can check upstairs. Ooh, cat poster. Wait, no, is that? I thought that was a cat poster. It's an Enderman with a bow tie. Uh oh, that that's just you, Liv. <laughs> hey there, buddy. Uh... It, it seems like I only have like an hour more until she closes, so I'd like to like speak with her quickly before it gets too late. Yara? I don't know where she is. You can, oh, she's up there. How did I miss her? Okay, let's. I'm gonna probably not get stuff today, but you know what? That's fine. Hello there. Welcome to my cafe. I'm Liara, the owner. Here we show a true passion for cooking. And bring the best food you can find. I'm happy to teach you how to cook if you don't know how. Uh, yeah, no. I'm definitely not going to be able to work it out. <laughs> well, that's just awesome. I'm happy to teach you. To get started, you are going to need some a sort of utensil. The most basic one would be the kitchen counter. In combo with a knife. Um, you'll also need to know how to prepare recipes. You can buy a bunch from me, but here's pickled turnip to start with. You'll just have to add it to your knowledge <laughs> with right click. To see it, just grab yourself a recipe book, select the utensil, and then the recipe. Oh, okay. Then you'll be able to see a list of items on the right hand side. Oh, okay, that's, that's actually pretty simple. I think I've got this. Ish, ish. <laughs> if you have the ingredients and the utensil in place, clicking cook will place all the ingredients in the utensil. 
Wait, into the utensil? Okay. Not gonna question that. It should start cooking then. Unless you're using counter, of course. Then you'll need to chop with the right click. Okay. You know what? I think this is actually... I would not have been able to figure this out on my own, but I think I can kind of do this. If you need additional cookware, I'm happy to sell them to you. But they're only available at weekends. One last thing. The recipes in the book are very basic. Oh. <laughs> Wait. There's a twist. Oh, no. You should try experimenting by adding extra ingredients. You might be able to make a better version. Oh, that's really cool. It'll probably come out worse, but, you know, it's okay. Thanks for your time. <gasps> okay, we picked up quite a few things. Oh, wow, this actually matches our kitchen. <laughs> Wonderful. Okay, what did we get? We got the chicken note, cooking recipe note, the cooking note, the kitchen counter note, and the recipe book. Oh, recipe book! That's what I'm really excited about. Oh, this is so cool! Okay, welcome to the build your own recipe book. Inside you can often find nothing. Oh. <laughs> You'll need to teach yourself a few recipes first. You can buy some from the cafe. There are also a rumor going around that the townspeople have some secret recipes of their own. Ooh! Perhaps you should get to know them too. Mm, pretty cool with that. So we have the cooking pot, the food mixer, and the oven. And I think... Oh! I did something. I don't know what I did, but I'm really excited! Okay, uh... What did I do? I don't know. Did, I feel like it added one. Did it add the oven? Oh! <gasps> okay, there's a lot of things going on. It shows me cooked mutton, recipe raw mutton. Cook, cook. Oh my god, it automatically cooks it for me! Oh, <gasps> yes! That, that, wow, okay, this is a lot to go through. We're not going to be able to do this today, guys. Maybe in the next episode, but that means I will see you guys next time. Thank you so much for watching. Emmy says hi to you all. Don't forget to leave a comment deciding on what I should name my other dogs and what kind of color collar they should have. And with that, guys, I will see you next time. Leave a like if you enjoyed the video, subscribe, and comment on down below. See you next time. Bye!